This module is really just a survey of the different options that you have for managing your content. Um, you may never actually implement every single one of these features that we go over, but at least you'll know that they do exist in case uh, you do find a use for them um, in your own implementation. So let's go ahead and get started here on managing objects. Let's take a look at the different ways that you can manage content inside of your library. First way we'll look at managing content is through release dates. Release dates are a flag that you can set on your content so that you know where it is in the document lifecycle. We'll be talking about release dates and how you can set up a sample workflow. Then we'll be taking a look at our version control option how version control works, why it may be useful for you. Next, we'll be taking a look at object variance. Object variance is, is kind of the uh, cousin to version control. We'll take a look at uh, the benefits of using variance and how those work as well. And then last but not least, we will look at edit history. Edit history is basically track changes that you can set up for your object so you can view changes to that object over time.